Hello YouTube, Utakata J6 again with another episode of the Let's Play. Today we're going through with the first part of the plans featured in episode 0. You'll notice that the world is reloaded, but it's the same world. You'll also notice that some of the meat resources are carved out. What we're doing is we're now back on the original save. We're still on extreme mode, we just did a little bit of shenanigans with the save files. If people really want to know just how I got from a copy version of this world to this world once again, I can go through that. It's basically just a principle of um, changing the game back from extreme to survival to extreme again. Um, however, we're ready to go. Let's get, let's get down to business. Same world. About the same start. One side effect of this is, of course, losing your experience. Oh, this is nice. Losing your experience points. So I'm down from level, I think, 7 to uh, just this little bit here. Today we're going to start out the proper way, the way most of you have to start out Minecraft. And that would be a simple shelf to get through the night. Because if I remember correctly, I don't think there's enough there's as much time as there was before for going through the same process. No, again, I haven't started over. We're going to get back to the original village out that way at some point. But first of all, I want to mark this place off now. Again, just a reminder, this is only stage 2. There's still stage 3 left when some of the terrain generation mods from 1.2 start being released. And we need MC Edit back so we can use schematic files and move everything over for the final save. At that point, we'll be able to explore caves and really have some fun. But for now... For now, we've got starting again to deal with. Not the same wood, even the same trees that I'd cut down originally. Although I don't believe any of you saw that bit. In a way, it's almost like this is an episode zero, or an episode one of sorts. But, we won't focus on that. We've got important things to do. After all, this is still extreme mode. There's dying that could happen. We don't have much food. We don't have much anything. Now, there are a lot of different types of shelters you can build if you're starting out for the first day. I'm sure most of you watching would know this, of course. I think I've had my fill of cave shelters. We'll build a simple one, but I think I'm gonna have time to start over. Oh, okay, maybe not. Oh, look at that. I guess it happens from time to time. The sun sets and you don't have a shelter around. Hmm. Well, we've got a whole six dirt. Now we've almost tripled that. All right. So if I were just making my basic cave shelter. Honestly, this would about do it. I can see out. Oh, no, I can't see out. That's what I'm going to do. There we go. I believe this gets me proof from any mobs, but I can still see what time it is. So here's my basic sort of cave setup. Get us a crafting table in here. Get rid of some of this more useless stuff. Unfortunately, all the 
charcoal was gone, so we would have to make charcoal. That or eat raw food. Alright. Let's keep going. Anything here. Nothing at all. Starting over is hard in a way. Sure, this isn't quite starting over, but still. Alright. Things you can do in a cave setup is, of course, expand your cave a little bit during the night. Expand your house, rather, and hope you hit a dungeon or a cave. A labyrinth of some kind. But honestly, here, I'm just collecting some stone. With the experience of a whole seven episodes under our belt, we're probably well equipped enough to Head out and build them nice, no? Lots of mobs. Lots of mobs. Alright. Leave our shelter exposed in case we have to run away. This is extreme after all. Life does get rather, well, extreme at times here. Alright. This area looks to me like a perfect place for a watchtower. A more sophisticated home. All we gotta do is avoid aggroing skeletons, creepers. Creeper's a little closer to comfort. I'd like a few more trees for this house. This outpost. This fort. This stronghold against the shadows. Oh, shoot. Look at that. Creeper already. Skeleton sees us and starts trying to shoot, we could be in real trouble. This makes me think of good times playing on Skyblock. Of course, that just makes me want a cobble generator. Dimensions in fives. Dimensions in fives. by five. Now, if we had more resources, we could go up another level. But we don't have more resources. If we want more trees, we have to face them. Them being the non-discriminate forces of not good. Of course, 
that's just not a good idea without... See, what else I say? I say don't eat the food if it's raw. <sighs> because you get food poisoning. What do I do? Get food poisoning. Earth was the point of... 